this lesson, you will delve a little deeper into sharding. You'll learn what sharding is and how it happens. You'll learn about data skew and how that affects your database. You'll learn about shard keys and how to choose a shard key for your tables. Single store is a distributed database where data is spread out to partitions on leaf nodes. All of the partitions hold some of the data for your database. In this small sample cluster with an aggregator and two leaves, we have 16 partitions, eight on each leaf, and the data is distributed across all of the partitions across the two leaves. If there were six leaf nodes in this cluster and 48 partitions, it would be distributed across all of them. The aggregator does the job of distributing the data throughout the cluster, and that process is known as sharding. If the sharding goes well, you will end up with database partitions that are balanced, with roughly the same amount of data in each partition. The database has very little skew. However, if for some reason the aggregator has distributed the data unevenly, so that data is not spread evenly, we end up with data skew. In cases where there is skew, some partitions will have more work to do than others, and will therefore take longer, while partitions with less data will take less time. The cluster, database, and a particular table are only as fast as their slowest partition. In the end, this is a waste of the computing power on the leaf. Ideally, all of the partitions would take the same amount of time to complete a task, thereby making most efficient use of leaf nodes' compute and memory resources. Let's create this orders table. We'll use a shard key to define how the table will be sharded. Let's put the shard key on the primary key, order ID. 